How you going, my preciouses? That's right, I just gollumed you. Let's head back to Destination Perfect today. Bam! 10 out of 10. This old timer is absolutely living his best life. Oh, a backflip! He's making me look forward to retirement. I also want to become a silly bugger full time at the local pool. Wowee, his impersonation of a salmon is bang on. Hoppy one, hoppy two, twist and shout, splash! Cue Tom Petty free balling over that one. Go big or go home. 1.5 flippies, fuck yes. Meanwhile, over on dry land, anyone saying YouTubers are not athletic can eat a bag of dicks. Marquez Brownlee is a frisbee god. Is that a touchdown? Do you call that a touchdown? He quickly looks at the tech specs of the frisbee. Hopefully it's available to consumers soon. That's a lot of selfie sticks. Oh no, they're kicky sticks. Holy mother of shitballs. Replay that moment of human and perfection. Crikey. Dribbling, dribbling. Whoa! Destination perfect! Yeah, nah, yeah. Go the Tillies. The support for the Women's FIFA World Cup this year was undeniably fair dinkum perfect. But doing your own thing and avoiding bandwagons is also an example of destination perfect. This fella deciding to watch Gandalf reuniting with the Hobbits instead of the soccer football is next level wholesome AF. When the one ring whispers your name and you feel like watching Peter Jackson's masterpiece, you do it. You answer the call, you scratch that itch and you watch the shit out of it. From one geeky topic to the next, I am deep into Tears of the Kingdom. My destination perfect happy place would be to become as good at the game as this legend. Look at that! One hit with a fused royal Gibdo Claymore and the bloody mini boss fight is over. I usually die 12 to 23 times before I win these battles. Don't get me started on Lionels either. Those wankers often have me rage quitting. Anyway, I'm not like jealous. Oh man, huge thanks to Kathy for sending this video in to me of her hubby Steve learning to walk again. This is a working example of how to pull yourself out of destination fucked and enter destination perfect. One step at a time. You can't hurry, you can't be impatient. Short term goals only. Let's give Steve a massive fuck yes in the comments everyone. Come on, here's one for the Canadians because you bloody love this sport. Now you see it, now you don't goal. Winner winner, Tim Hortons dinner. Oh yeah, let's give the show pony a cheeky replay. It's quite weird watching an ice hockey video without fisticuffs. Oh wrong video, this video is in the wrong compilation. Why have I forsaken you? No! This smooth bastard is swooping their way towards the perfect landing. You can be my paragliding wingman anytime. Don't, don't fall off, that would be awkward. Okay, let's end on this dog just bloody having a crack at its big ball. It was tempting to make the last word there a plural, but I didn't, perhaps a sign of maturity in old Aussie man. Nah, fuck that. Lick your balls, sniff them, headbutt them. Do it all, little buddy. Do everything you can dream of with your balls while you're young and free and have the energy. Play with your big balls in the morning, day, night. As the saying goes, practice makes destination perfect. He practices with his balls a lot. Many of us do. Okay, that's enough. Thank you for watching, everyone. Send your videos into aussieman.com slash submit. aussiemanshop.com for merch. Cheers.